Aloha, welcome to the Thai Law Forum. Today we are at the Big Dog Cafe with co-owners Kun Bui and Kun Bird. Yeah. I'm just going to ask them a bit about their cafe here. So how did you guys come up with the concept of the Big Dog Cafe? Okay, first of all, so we, we last many years we have a Alaskan Malamut farm, kennel. Yeah. So we have a kennel in a lot of Yeah. So we have about six or seven dogs, right? Yes. Then, like, a, oh, why? He just came up with the idea, right? Yeah. Like, a, why don't we can play with our dogs? Yeah. And we have the building, right? We have the building and we have dogs. Yeah. Why don't we have something we can play with the dog and we can make some profits also? Make some profit. Yeah. yeah. See? <laughs> <laughs> and so you also have not just big dogs, but you've got small dogs as well, right? Yeah, because yeah. small dog. Since we opened the cafe, right? Yeah. Then we opened the cafe on Lat Road. Yeah. Okay, for uh, last last January. Yeah. Then we just we have customer coming. Okay, and then we just start importing dogs, yeah. right? And we also importing small dog also. Yeah. Oh, which What's one? His name? His yeah. name? His right? name? His name is Gato, right? Gato. 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 And yeah. where is Gato from? He's from Russia. Russia. And what, what breed is Gato? This is Bolsoy. 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 <laughs> <laughs> and can you... Um, See how beautiful he is? He is gorgeous. Very yeah. gorgeous. Such a good boy. Standing here. <laughs> he just came last two weeks. Oh, okay. So he's quite new. Just came, just came. And can you tell us how many dogs you have in the facility altogether? So how many? Um, how many dogs we have? Thirty dogs. Thirty, 30 dogs yeah. in total. Mm -hmm. And how do you how do you take care of the dogs properly? What kind of measures do you do to make okay. sure they're safe? So and we keep we keep them all. Yeah. In we have AC room, okay. and they they stay in one like a one one loom yeah uh, like together. a one cage one cage yeah. one one big cage yeah okay stainless steel mm -hmm. with with one dog yeah yeah and then we have about we have six person oh, six staff members six staff yeah uh, take care of them yeah 24 hours oh okay that's great <laughs> and how involved are you two in the business do you come here every day are you more operational uh he's the owner okay yeah. and he came yeah. every day right you come mm -hmm. Every day, yeah. okay. <laughs> so obviously you guys have been very successful with tourism stuff that you've moved to a bigger location. Yep. Yeah? Yep, he just uh, accidentally, he drove, he drove here, yeah. and he found, oh, this one for Lento. Oh, okay. Yeah, he, but but quite expensive. Right. Because this is a, like a, in downtown area, right? Yeah. Uh, near the MRT. Yeah. Mata, right? MRT, yeah. right? You guys are right next door to the MRT. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. one. So we want to have Thai, Thai culture. Thailand cultural yeah, center. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it's expensive, but it has its benefits. It's close to public <laughs> transport, so that's sure. you get in a lot sure, of Sure, sure, sure. Just by chance, you know. Yeah. <laughs> um, so obviously, animal cafes are a huge trend in not only Thailand, mm -hmm. but a lot of countries right now, like mm -hmm. Japan mm -hmm. and Australia. Mm -hmm. What do you think makes your cafe so unique compared to other animal cafes in Bangkok? Uh -huh. We, we, we don't know Arthur, you know. We don't know any other. Yeah, we, yeah. Don't, we don't know any Arthur, but here yeah. we just want to import any breed that we love yeah. to have, okay. right? But uh, uh, mostly a uh, big breed, right? Yeah. Right. And then uh, I somebody said we are unique because we have something that different. Yeah. Like Arthur Cafe, maybe it's, they have small. Yeah. And and we have something very different. Yeah. Like we have ball soy. Yeah. We have uh, yeah. we have common dog. Yeah. Very big guy, you know. You have a Tibetan mastiff as well. And we have Tibetan though. mastiff. Yes. So doesn't it is it worrying that because Thailand is such a humid and hot country, how do you cool down the dogs? Because obviously some of them, like the Tibetan mastiff you have, <laughs> have a lot of hair. Isn't it too hot for them? Sure, because uh, most of them. Yeah. Okay, they stay in the AC room. Yeah. Only when then the time that we they, they come here yeah. to play with our customer. Are they out? Yeah, the only few minutes. Okay. Only few minutes. So so up up upstairs we have yeah. very cold room yeah. and yeah. 
So how does your business operate? Because I see you have certain set times for each dog to come down and play. Yeah. So how would, how does that schedule work? Okay, schedule work. Okay. Uh, we start from small dog, right? Yes. Oh, is that early from, in the morning? So we have small dog. We have the early okay. in the morning, yeah. nine o'clock. Yeah. We open nine o'clock. Yes. Right, and then <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have to ask. Uh, yeah. uh, we open nine o'clock, yeah. and then uh, each each uh, session. We have seven or eight group of dogs coming. Okay, yeah. Okay, about two and a half hours. Yeah. For for one one session. Yeah. Okay. So we start from small dog. Yeah. Small dog and then we just introduce our customer. Yeah. Small dog first. So they will get used to small dog, right? Yeah. They are prepared to see the bigger one. Yeah. Right? And then uh, each day we have about um, how many oh. how many rounds? Five? Five. And how, how long five. is each round? How long each round? Two and a half hours. So they, they each will come out play for two hours and no. then they go back up. Okay. In two and a half hours, yeah. we have about seven groups of dogs. Oh, okay. Seven yeah. or eight groups of dogs, right? Yeah. And then first group will be Pomeranian. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's sorry. Pomeranian, like a Pomeranian with Corky. Corky. Oh, okay. Chisu. Uh, Chisu. Yeah. Uh, we have Chisu. We have uh, Cardigan, Corky. Okay, we yeah. have we have two type of corgi. You've got the Welsh corgi. We right? have uh, they are Welsh, okay. Yeah. They, they, we have Frembo, okay. and we have Cardigan Welsh corgi. Okay. So yeah. you can see the corgi with uh, blue eyes. Yeah. yeah. When they come out to play, is that their exercise, or do you exercise them and train them um, in other areas? Uh, like a, we plan to, you know, dog will come down. Yeah. Like a five times a day, yeah. <laughs> like this. So I think they have plenty of exercise, of exercise already, yeah, right? That's true. <laughs> yeah. And but dog swimming. And they go oh, swimming as well. We have swimming pool also. Is that um is that for them to so to each, train or so, no each each of them yeah. will swim. Yeah, okay. Each week, you know. In oh, okay. maybe once a week. One week. Can people swim with them or sure. Is it just sure if you want. Visitors can swim? Yeah. much for joining us today here at Thai Law Forum. Sure. Thank you too as well. Kapkunka. Kapkunka.